What's going on guys? Chase with iDub Hockey here to do a review on the new Bauer Supreme 3S Pro Ice Hockey Skate. So below the boot we have the Tuke Edge holder which allows you to swap out damaged or broken steel in seconds with this quick release trigger system. Really cool big upgrade with the new LS Pulse steel with a power profile. Now this is an all new set of materials with an all new construction process that is way, way better than what we have seen in the past from the LS4 and the LS3. Um, just much more consistent, like I said, and just overall with that high polish finish, gonna give you some better glide as well. The other really cool thing that the pulse that comes on this 3S Pro has a quad profile from ProSharp. So the two center radii here creates a lot more contact between the runner and the ice surface, so it gives you a lot better stability. Whereas the toe and the heel still help to maintain that high level of agility, so really just giving you an overall better balanced feel so you can, can get that super explosive stride. Another big upgrade in the first time we see in this line is the composite outsole that is significantly lighter than the plastic TPU we see in the 3S, also very stiff and very rigid. Same thing can be said about the 3D lasted curve composite. Now in years past, this has been the premier material Bowers use in their top end skates because of just how lightweight and how responsive it is. The other really cool notable feature is that it's a very thermoformable too. So combining with the new Aerofoam Plus pads on the inside, this gives you a crazy custom like fit and feel before you ever hit the ice. So super comfortable, but also helps to reduce break-in times a lot. Now another really cool feature, and first time we see it in this Supreme line, is the asymmetrical toe cap. So based off hundreds of thousands of scans, courtesy of their 3D scanner, re-engineered the overall shape of the toe box to help significantly reduce wasted internal space. So for you as a player, you're gonna feel a lot more connected since your toes aren't you know, moving around nearly as much with this lower profile design. Also much more comfortable since they lined the entirety of the toe cap with felt. So killer, killer upgrade that we find this year. And it is slightly different dimensions than what we see in Vapor. Now for the tendon guard, we have the Reflex. It has been re-engineered a little bit this year, fully injected, so very, very durable. It's gonna last a long time. But the main idea behind this is that it allows you for allows you to get the full stride extension all the way through the toe snap for that powerful explosiveness. And it also has a little bit of snap to it. So as you fully extend out, it helps to push you back into the restarting position for better stride frequency. At the tops of the quarter package, we have their Comfort Edge wraps. Very, very plush with such a stiff boot. You gotta have a little bit of give somewhere to help prevent any of that high ankle abrasion, which is really key for those players that are playing four or five times a week. Now into the tongue, this is what they call their Reflex Classic Pro. It's a 52 ounce felt with thick foams down through the center, a slight metatarsal guard up front, great protection for the top of the foot, helps to prevent lace bite, but gives you great forward flex so you can get into that deep knee bend to start that big stride. As we get into the liner, I mentioned earlier, we have the Aerofoam Plus pads. These are super lightweight, very thermoformable, and really, really comfortable. On top of that, we have their lock fit liner, dual zone material, so the upper portion helps to wick away moisture, keep your feet dry. The bottom portion has a little gritty, a little more of a gritty texture to help keep your feet planted in, but both of these are very, very durable and a very common request at the pro level. We also have a bit of anti-abrasion uh, patches at the top of the eyelets on the inside. Really key for those players that wear the shin guards underneath the tongue. Uh, really just to help this, you know, high-end skate really perform, function, and last a long time. Now we have the lock fit footbed that has a bit of a gritty texture or a sticky texture in the back heel portion, really help, helping to keep your feet planted. Same thing with the toes. Sounds pretty minimal, but go ahead and try these on. Wiggle your, wiggle your toes around a little bit and you'll definitely notice it. And then as far as the fit profile goes, I'd usually go into Supreme how it's a medium volume fit. 
That has changed this year. Bauer introduced their new fit system that offers three different fits for the low, medium, and high profile footed players out there. So the fit one is essentially a low profile fit for players that have a narrow forefoot and a shallow overall instep or a shorter instep. Uh, you could really think of this as very, very similar to a classic Vapor D skate size. Now for fit two, this is the standard where most players will fall into. Uh, this is a standard forefoot width and a standard depth for your instep. Uh, very, very similar to the Supreme D size right now. And then lastly, for fit three, um, this is a hybrid between Nexus D and a Supreme Double E. So really think of these players that have a really wide forefoot and a really tall overall instep. So if you're looking for more information about how to find your fit, or if you're just looking for more information on this 3S Pro, hit the link in the description, give us a thumbs up on the video. While you're there, make sure you're subscribed to the number one hockey gear review channel on YouTube. See you guys next time.